I really think this game is going to be pretty interesting. I really think that they have the better heroes, but if we actually synergize well and make sure we pressure them early because we have earlier power spike, then we can actually win this pretty easy, right? Hey guys, what's up? It's Raza with another video. And today we're gonna play the mid lane again. We're gonna play Pagna. Okay, thank you, man. We're gonna play Pagna. We're gonna try this hero in 7.25c. I think, like, this hero is probably, like, one of the top heroes, at least in my opinion, due to the um, ultimate buff, which, as you see, it has, like, 7, uh, seven seconds cooldown. And it's pretty much crazy because the moment you get to level 6, you can actually spam and have infinite mana and infinite health as well. Uh, we're gonna see, we have I think Ember Spirit in the mid lane, I think this is a matchup that we will not have that much of an issue, right? At least in the beginning. Uh, my thought is if I'm going for the Decrep or I'm going for the Blast to actually destroy his shield if he tries to push a lane. But most likely I'll just go for the Decrep, I'm still not sure, maybe I... The Decrep most likely secures me uh, a range creep or at least secures a deny in my range creep and the blast secures the range creep puts the lane and it helps me actually push under his tower and try to deny regardless we're going to see my first art uh, starting items are these like maximum stats i'm going for the null I'm going then for the healing salve probably i'm gonna get these two items together and then what i'll do is get a bottle like bottle really good especially you know when you play versus a hero that actually wants runes right so ember spirit storm spirit void spirit all these kind of heroes i'm gonna get the salt here immediately all these heroes actually wants the runes right so anyway we'll start the matchup oh it's willow meat what yeah he plays ward wow yeah he actually has better animation right he actually has really good animation so i'm gonna get actually a center as well wow oh shit i'm gonna bring this item I think I'm playing a little bit sloppy, right? So I'm just gonna decrypt here. I'm, I'm just gonna keep denying the range grip. That was actually really cute, what he actually uh, went, went for there. actually went to blast all of them the uh, the point of actually pushing under the lane is this to deny under the tower that's that's the reason why we push him in the beginning immediately now I have more region I'm just gonna push a lane because I also want to um, I also want to get his word Oh shit, oh, fuck that. Perfect. Perfect. I'm actually having some mana issues, so I'm just gonna use the decrep from now on until I get my bottle. Oh fuck, I fucked up a little bit. Come on, deny. But I really think Pagna is really good against Willow, right? If I don't screw things up, then most likely I'm gonna I'm gonna have huge advantage when I get my level six. So in order to do that, I need to actually uh, make sure I have the advantage in terms of last hits, right? Or at least I won't get denied that hard. 
if I do that, most likely um, I'm gonna win this matchup. I think we actually have denied him a lot, even without the crab. I think we are actually having great, 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 great lane. So I'm actually getting my bottle. Uh, getting the crypts here, I don't want them under the tower, right? And the good thing is I'm actually quite fast, so I'm actually gonna get... Uh, I'm actually pushing the lane a little bit. I don't mind about that. Yeah. And I'm gonna get the region bot, which is perfect. He actually got his the bottle, so that's actually really good for us, right? Because he we just have the we just have the the rune denied for him. Probably gonna get boots, right? Most likely, though, he he's gonna try to kill him. Level six. Yeah, it's really good. I'm actually gonna stack, right? I'm just actually gonna stack here and maybe stack it twice um, later on because I want the jungle items. I'm just losing creeps here, but I don't mind. So we have boots now. So what we'll do is push a lane, get the level six and start sacking this guy. And most likely he's going here to get the run right? Sure. So we'll just meet him here halfway and we'll just suck this guy. This is why scan is so important, right? He's dead, now we're just gonna push with the catapult. I'm actually gonna get the ward as well in the mid lane. Don't forget the ward when it's night time. <laughs> really good job. Like, we're doing really good. So, what I'll do, I'm probably gonna rotate, get all the tier 1, right? I said in the beginning, if we actually coordinate, then we're most likely going to win this game. Just go kill him. Go get tower. And do you want to play that aggressive with Pagna? Well, if I have a really good uh, start, then I really, I really, like, you have to play, especially when I feel like we're on the clock, right? I mean, Weaver, it's not that great of a carry. Even, like, with all the buffs, it's really squishy. And if you see our lineup, all we do is have the potential to, you know, have pickups, right? Can we kill him? I mean, he just tip it, right? No. Uh, can I suck him? Just gonna place a word here, actually. I mean, I feel like a little bit stressed, but so far so good. The good thing, like, if you notice, like, the buff that Pagna got, actually, you know, we just used double. Which has just double ultimate in a single fight, right? It's actually it's actually crazy. Yeah, no, chill man. Need all my mana.
Ah, shit, got denied. I actually didn't pay attention to that. That's pretty sloppy. So, what's the plan right now? The plan is I want to be active, right? And probably I want to, be, to have Nyx Assassin with me. So, it's not really smart to go there because I don't have a frontliner with me. What I want to do is play with my Nyx Assassin. And this is what I'm going to do the whole game. Pats is also a really good partner with me. Um, but, like, the least, like, the player I want the least to be with me is Weaver, right? She doesn't contribute anyhow to the Pagna playstyle. Um, what items do I need here? Maybe I even need a Glimmer Cape here. I'm actually starting to think that this is a really good uh, play because if I'm actually not careful, this Willow can destroy me. Oh shit. Yeah, so I have this Nether Ward. He can't really. Yeah, Nether Ward. Like, you have to be really smart when playing with someone else. Let's go get this bar outpost. But, you know, I feel like I'm so squishy right now, but I guess it's just Pagna, right? I'm so squishy, and we need to do something about that. So maybe even, uh, maybe we get the Glimmer Cape. And do I need the movement speed? I don't think I need to run from someone, right? So most likely I'm gonna need the health. I really don't feel like I need to run from someone. Like PA, I can deal with her most likely unless I get two shot or something. That's weird. They're so using fortifications here. Yeah. Oh fuck. Come to me. Really good. Really good. I mean like this is what I meant in the beginning. If we play on high tempo we can actually destroy them before their timings. And I, I can't even call this a stomp, right? I just can't call this a stomp. Uh, maybe, do we need Graves? Maybe I even go for the Graves. I think I like that. I'll just go for the Graves. I know it's like a little bit weird and people usually go for the Axe. Kaya is also good as well. Um, but maybe Graves, you know, assist me because it can remove chains and so on and, you know, I have constant regen and I can assist my team. So I'm, I'm just going for that. Also, Boots of Travel would be a really good uh, item, but let's go for Graves right now. I can, I'm really curious to actually... To actually this build, to try this out. I really don't like there. I, don't, I really don't like what we're going to do here. Yeah, it's not that smart. Oh shit! Can you stand? He's dead to the bug, right? Yep, ultimate, good thing. I'm gonna bring the mech here. Come get the tower. Probably I might even like bug or that. Oh shit, yeah, they see us here. Come here, Nyx, come here. And I'll, like, this is like, I'm one of the guys that actually hates Arcane Boots, right? But in this particular game, I just like this Arcane Boots on X. It's like a really fast Arcane Boots and actually assists to do what we want to do. Like end this game really, really, really fast. Uh, 
I'm gonna need a lot of mana potions. I don't really like like that we are here without Weaver, but she's a little bit underfarmed as well. Can we actually siege or something? No nether ward, be careful. I'm just placing it here. So, you know, they just won't scout it there. I don't like that. Fuck me. Yeah, I need the Greaves because I don't have mana. Ah, that's a little bit deep, boys. I'm just tipping tall because there's so much farm here. That's the only reason. I just need my Greaves first. Bondurons. Can you let me that, please? So, I I'm actually really, like, happy uh, the last few days because every single game I had, you know, people start to communicate. Maybe I got lucky, but, you know, people actually start to talk more. Okay, and now we have ultimate again, so I'm just gonna go a little bit caught here. I don't like that. Shit. Yeah, I became a little bit cocky in pressing the mech here, so I won't get damage from the maledict. What? If I get the Greaves... Okay. Okay, let's go high ground. I have Greaves. Go, go, go. Like, high tempo. Do not let them get any kind of breathe. We have a color belt. We can just do it. And the reason why I don't want my Greaves right now, and I'm just clicking here, is to use my Arcane Boots first. Slowly seeds. And I'm just like, the moment where I don't have Nether Blast, right? If I don't have Nether Blast, then I'm just backing off, right? Like, even if he's not dead, I really don't mind that. Okay, cool. Yep, nether word. Good, good, good. No. Okay, like high tempo. Again, we have to do it really, really, really safe. Really, really, really safe, right? We blast, we go back. We cannot underestimate here. Yeah. I actually didn't like the placement here of the nether world. Oh, fuck. Yeah, that, that ultimate was not that good for my, like, I didn't suck that good.
I feel like we just won the game here, right? Like, this graves actually so much value in the end. I'm really happy it worked out. But again, it was one of the games that we knew that... Let's go back. Uh, that we knew that... Fuck. I don't have mana. I should have TP there. It's one of the games that we knew we had to pressure them. Because late game, most likely, we didn't have a chance. Um, what do I need here? I'm thinking of Kaya, but Kaya will not save me if I get jumped on, right? And I think this is what they want to do right now. They just want, yeah, they just want to jump on me. So maybe we'll just go for for the Glimmer Cape. It's actually really sweet of an item. Probably we're going Glimmer Cape. Oh, can I have Jelly? Jelly is actually great for me. And since I'm so vulnerable, I'll just try to go for Ram Pressing Strength. Oh, Nether Soul. Actually, Nether Soul. Can I have that? Yeah, like I don't hesitate, so I'm gonna place uh, the words here. Can I have that? So, um, there's not much to say here, rather than we just kept uh, the tempo high and the rest of the team actually understood that. But I think overall, even in lower MMR games, it's so easy to have high tempo, right? Because people, usually people want to um, fight, you know, and, uh, and always be aggressive. I think what people actually lack is the ability to slow the pace, right? And actually try to farm. Okay, let's let's start from both. Okay, cool. Vents with a solar crest. I'm not really sure. I think it's a great item, but. Maybe we need a force of as well, right? Because it's all about me sieging. And, you know, maybe if we ever get exposed, maybe we won't force stuff. Yeah, I'm not gonna do the same mistake and I'm gonna keep the nether words behind. Yeah, don't mind about that. Oh, fuck. Yeah, griefs. Shit. Like really simple execution. We like managed to do the best in the mid lane, and then we just you know understood what lane needed help. We just rotated, got the tower, and just keep going forward with the correct items. And I think this game was pretty easy overall. And I really, really think fuck. I really, really think that we do not have the better heroes. I think they have better heroes. Um, probably go for Netherworld. Even though in this game maybe Blast makes more sense because this is like what I constantly use. Oh shit. Yeah. I, I like that was a mistake because I panicked to use immediately the. Um, uh, panicked immediately to use my ultimate. I should I should have the crap first. So fuck that. I want to buy back. Ugh. Never mind. This game is probably over. Anyway, like to sum up, how we actually managed to have a really decent landing stage. First of all, uh, Willow is a decent mid, right? I don't think Willow is a like top tier mid, but you know there are Willow players out there, really high MMR as well, and they just execute a hero. Unfortunately, I'm not one of those. Anyway. What we did is push a lane, secured as many denies and you know last kids as we could, and we got level six earlier. That means we had kill potential, right? If Willow for any reason had more levels than us, we were, you know, the one to die most likely. Uh, anyway, 
The second thing is that we actually force the tower and we try by pushing the lanes to get uh, the rune, right? The moment we got the rune, we like we pushed, we scanned here, and we actually went for it because we're level 6 and we got the kill, that's all. And the third thing is that, okay, the moment we got tier 1, there was nothing for us to, to do, you know, in the mid lane. So, what we did actually was... Oh shit. Yep, Griff's good item. This is why I got Griff's as well for the Willow. Um, the third thing is, okay, we start rotating and pretty much that was it. Simple executions, this is what you need to do generally. Now, Pagna is a little bit niche, right? He's a kind of hero that closes the game um, immediately, right? He can, he can actually win a game 20, 30 minutes in. Like, solid strength towers. That, I mean, other heroes have other, like, uh, strengths. What is this guy doing? I feel like they are just coming to us like creeps right now. I think they just gave up. Anyway, good game. Uh, there's not much more I'll say that multiple times to say here. I think like the basic of the mid lane, you know, you just I just demonstrate them, right? And I uh, maybe I have the edge, right? But, again, I'm not a Willow expert, so I'm not really sure if this guy actually um, played that good. I guess, you know, he could actually play better. <laughs> oh, anyway, uh, fun game. I think it's instructive. I think, like, we stomped them, but I'll say that again. It was something that we had to do, it was like all in, make sure we, we most likely had to do this play because otherwise we would lose late game. Or at least that's my assumption. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, if you like this kind of content please like and subscribe. It actually motivates me a lot to make more videos just like this, you know, where I consciously talk about what I do and my thoughts behind that. Guys, I really hope you improve. I really hope you like this video and I'll see you tomorrow. GG.